What's up, guys? Welcome to your Sweat Saturday. All right, today's going to be dope. It is a partner workout. Now, this one's going to be interesting because I've been throwing these out, as I said earlier this week. I don't want to limit you guys. I want to see how far you guys can freaking go. So this one between you and your partner, this first segment, everything that I'm about to explain is a total of 50 reps. All right. So on your 50 reps, the first movement you have is the rower. All right. Now, again, your coach may bring out uh, a bike so you guys can scale it, but I think the rowers will be sufficient unless classes get too crazy. I know they're real popular, but we'll see. But anyway, between you and your partner, you have a total of 50 calories to complete on the rower. Whenever you guys finish, you both will move up to hand release push ups. All right. On these hand release push ups, all right, you're controlling your body weight down. All right. As you get down to the ground, take your hands off and then fully lock out. That's one. Same thing can also be done on your knees. I'm good with either option. Just make sure hand placement is everything. Hands right under your chest and shoulder area, keeping those elbows nice and tight so we're not hurting our rotator cuff. Between you and your partner, you have 50. And between the calories, and the push-ups, I recommend y'all split it down to even. So it can be 25 and 25, or you can go 10, 10, however you want to do it. But work your way as a team to get equal reps. Uh, third movement is going to be the dumbbell lunges. Now with the dumbbell lunges, I think I put 50 for guys, uh, 30 or 35 for the ladies. This can also be done with the kettlebell. But you're only going to need a kettlebell today. All right, that's it between you and your partner. You're going into reverse lunges or frontal lunges. It's totally up to you as preference. But I want you to make sure that you're powering off your front foot, not your back foot, and making sure that you're controlling that weight with a tall and proud chest. Between you and your partner, you got a total of 50 reps. Next move will be your total bar or your knee up. So because I don't have the space, because I'm right on my wall, I can't do total bars. For those that know how to do it, go ahead and do it. Or your coach can show you. But if you're going to be doing knee ups, um, I can stand up here and touch my ground, but if I'm at the north side gym and I'm on one of the higher bars, I can go gra grab a plyo box or a bench. I want to make sure that you're able to tap the ground, especially if you're first starting off, where you're controlling your knees up, tapping the ground, and then controlling up. Now, if you can do this without touching and you're not bouncing all around, sorry for the shaky voice, um, go ahead and do so. But between you and your partner, you have a total of 50 total bars or 50 knee ups. And yes, if you have a partner that's doing total bars and you're doing knee ups, that's totally cool. All right, after your total bars and knee ups, you're gonna now go to that same dumbbell or kettlebell, get to the plyo box. Same thing we did earlier this week. Only difference is we now, it's gonna be weighted step ups. When you get to a total of 50 between you and your partner, you are finished with the step ups. Now, basically, you're going back in the order that we finished it. So now, instead of step-ups, you're now going to go back to the total bars or the knee-ups. Once you get 50, you're then going to the lunges. Once you get 50, you're then going to the hand-release push-ups. And then once you get 50, you finish off with the calories at 50. So you'll notice we'll start at the, uh, the rower, finish all the movements, and then go back to the rower. Guys, in 35 minutes, you want to get as far as you can. But guess what? That's only the first portion. The second portion is the same exact thing in the same exact order. The only difference is it's 25 of everything. So 50 in and back, 25 in and back. But again, this is not designed for everybody to finish. All right. I just want to see how far you're going to get. And I don't want to limit you. Guys, this is going to be your sweat Saturday workout. It's not a lot of equipment you're going to need. You just need effort, consistency. This is a great day to invite a family or friends so if you know somebody has been thinking about me green go ahead and bring them to your coach or your gm at that gym and we'll love to get them in today's the big day of flag football we want to see everybody out there whether you're participating or just coming out to support let's pink out the park again i can't wait to see you make sure you get there early stretch 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 all right all right guys y'all take care we see you soon